Good morning and welcome. My name's Jay. This is my birthday celebration. I'm celebrating being online, being live, uh, using Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, YouTube, all these different facilities. I've been doing it for a year now, teaching you and helping you to get fit. So I've moved from a physical class in a studio, in a gym, to here digitally online. Join me in my celebration. So we're going to start off with a weights workout today. Let's have a warm up. So we're going to have a little march on the spot to begin with. So I think engage your core, stand up tall and proud. All right, I want you to lift those arms. So we're celebrating, yeah. Can you walk forward and walk back? So a little walk forward, walk back. All right, this time, push those arms out. So we want to warm up the whole of the body. We're going to have a whole body workout. Excellent. All right, let's hold it here. So take a little step to the side and in. Same side again. We're going to reach down, reach up. Reach down, reach up. Give me two more that way. And then we're going to change sides. Here we go. Step down, reach down, step in, reach up. So I hope you're feeling fit and well today. If you're joining in with me, make sure you've got space, you're wearing appropriate footwear. If you haven't got weights, you can still join in. Give me a march on the spot. So you can do the exercises just without the weights if you haven't got weights. All right, march it forward, push forward. March it back. And again. Two more times. Of course, you can just march on the spot if you haven't got room. Hold it here. We're going to take a little back lunge. Foot goes back, arms come forward. Take those feet apart now, give me a squat. So bend those knees, push your bum back. Reach it up and across now, stretch up. forward, arms reaching up. You can make that little jog now if you want to. So just warming up. One more time. Reaching down to the side. Here we go. Down low, stretch up tall. Down low, stretch up tall. Change sides. So let me know how you get on with this workout. Give me a like, leave me a comment, and always remember, subscribe to my channels, my YouTube channel, my Facebook page, and I'm on Instagram as well. Okay, legs wide, reach it up and across. Give me those wide leg squats. All right, back lunge. Take your foot back, arms forward. Change up to a forward lunge, this time with a bicep curl. 
So that heart rate should be getting up. Feeling a little bit more breathless. Feeling a little warmer. All right, let's start our workout then. So grab your weights if you've got some weights. Let's start with those legs together, a narrow squat. So keep those knees in, push your hips and bum back. Feet hip width apart this time, squats. Four more. And then we're going to go for a wide squat, so really nice and wide. Bring those weights in front of you. All right, bring your legs in, hip width apart. So, leaning forward from the hips, our deadlift. Squeeze your glutes, pull up tall. Back to that narrow squat, feet together. Take your foot out, shoulder width. Now take those feet out a little wider, turn your toes out, bring those weights together. So we squat down low, goblet squat, nice and low. All right, back to that deadlift, wiggle those feet in, here we go. Hinge forward, squeeze your glutes, as if you're thrusting those hips forward. So imagine you've got a really heavy weight, a long bar, lift it up. All right, place one weight down. So, whole body exercise now. We're going to squat, reach shin, shoulder, push up to the ceiling. So we're reaching across to the opposite shin, shoulder, push to the ceiling. Now make sure in that squat, you're still bending both legs equally. Good. Four more. Three, two, and then we're going to change arms. So same thing on the other side. Hand comes across, opposite shin, shoulder, and up. So squat, bend those knees, push your bum back, keep that weight equal. One more. Excellent. Now let's try a little bit of balance work and core work. Stand on one leg. Move the weight from side to side. So focus on something in front of you. Change legs. Lovely. All right, one more leg exercise. Some lunges. So let's have one leg forward, one foot on the top. Lunging down and up. Bend both knees. Keep the right. Mm -hmm. 
change legs. 10, here we go. All right, we're gonna come down to the floor, bring your weights with you. So, hands and knees, flat back, tummy pulled in, single arm rows, lift one arm and then the other. So squeeze your shoulder blades back as you lift that elbow. Keep your head and neck in line. Now we can make this harder by doing it on our toes. So feet wide. You choose your option. Excellent work, well done. All right, bring your weights together, hands on the floor. Mountain climber, bring your knee across towards your opposite wrist. And relaxing there. Okay, let's make our way over onto our back now. So work in the chest muscles. Our chest press. Elbows bent, push those hands up to the ceiling and back down. Strong arms, slow and controlled. Good, relaxing there. Now, Depending on your weight, we're going to do some tricep extension. So you might want to swap to a lighter weight. We're going to hold that weight up in the air. So hands this time pointing this way round. Elbows bend as you take the weights either side of your head and then straighten those arms up again. So elbows bending and straightening. So triceps are smaller muscle than the chest. Chest press we were using pecs shoulders and triceps so that's why you're struggling with this heavy weight you may need to drop to a lighter weight let's do two more good so change that weight again if you need to we're going to go back to that chest press elbows out at the side in line with your shoulders Imagine you've got a bar across your chest. Push it up to the ceiling. So breathing out as you push it up. Excellent, okay. Let's go back to those triceps. I'm gonna change my weights though. Lighter weight. So, hands up in the air, elbows bending either side of your ears. Make sure your elbows are pointing towards your knees, so don't let them flare out. One more. Good. All right, let's come back up to standing. Now, tricep extension, standing. Elbows, bend and straighten. Keep the shoulder and upper arm still. Change arm.
how are we doing? All right, single arm row, this time standing. So again, you're gonna want that heavier weight. All right, hand on your knee. So pull the shoulder back. Squeeze those shoulder blades. Change. So I've got the same arm this time on the leg. Give me support as I pull back. All right, now we can also do a standing row. So let's grab both weights again. Feet apart, knees bend, lean forward. And then imagine you're pulling those weights towards your tummy. Have your arms a little wider though. So squeeze your shoulder blades, draw those elbows back. Great work, all right. So we've worked a lot of the major muscles now. We've worked our chest, our back, a little bit of shoulders and triceps. We've worked our legs as well. How about some of the smaller muscles, our biceps? So. We're just going to do a bicep curl. Now you can have your weights this way round. It's called like a hammer curl, like you're holding a hammer. Or you can turn the palms this way round, a more traditional bicep curl. Keep your elbows glued in by your side. Good. All right, let's think about the lower legs now, calves. We can do some calf raises, so I'm just rising up and down on my toes. Now I'm only lifting upwards, they're not going downwards. So if you want a really good stretch and work out your calves, this is a good one to do on a step or a staircase. You might need to hold on and then you can lower those heels down so you get a nice stretch that way. Of course you can make it harder as well by just doing it on one leg. So of course you might want to hold on then. That's a little harder. Try it on the other leg. Good for challenging your balance as well. Fantastic. Okay. So, we're just now going to have a little stretch, having had a good workout. Pick up your foot, bring your knees together. So, stretch that quad. Push your knee down, push your heel towards your bum, and stretch up nice and tall. All right, change legs. So I hope you enjoyed that little workout today. Let me know, leave me a comment. Even if you're watching this at a later time today or later in the week. Love to know how you're getting on. All right, drop your foot back. Front leg stays straight, push your hips up and back. So you're tilting that pelvis getting a nice stretch in your hamstring. All right, change legs. You could tap your toes. Upper body stretch then. Let's have a tricep stretch first. Arm reaches up, drop it back. Give it a little pull back. Now, toes pointing forwards. Step back with one foot, bend the other knee, and we've got a little calf stretch at the same time. All right, change arms, so drop it back. Step foot back. Now, arms come behind your back. Lifting them up and back as we stretch out those chest and shoulders. Big wide stretch. Give yourselves a big clap there. Thank you for joining in with my birthday workout today. 
and I'll see you later in the week. I've got some more. We've got some yoga, some Pilates. We've got a HIT session, high intensity interval training. We're going to finish the week on Friday with relaxation. So join me for these short sessions. Let me know how you're getting on. <laughs>